American buffalo once roamed the western plains by the million, till it came into the gun sights of the men who hunted it for profit. MGM's unique story of these pioneer hunters is told through the strange partnership of two men. Strong, savage Charlie Gilson, played by Robert Taylor. Strong, gentle Sandy McKenzie, played by Stuart Granger. I changed my mind, mister. You want to go slaughtering buffalo, you go ahead. Me, I want to get the stink of them out of my insides. I'm fed up on killing. Seems like that's all I've ever known since I was a kid. Killing one kind or another. Well, there ain't nothing wrong with that. Killing's natural. Not to me, it ain't. Their fantastic, colorful story discloses a side of the American West never before filmed, full of excitement and danger. In brilliant Eastman color, photographed at great risk in its actual locale, the Black Hills of South Dakota. Unique, too, is the honesty of the portrayals. Russ Tamblin as the appealing red-headed half-breed. Lloyd Nolan as the tough, humorous buffalo skinner. Mr. Charlie, he sure hates the Indian, don't he? Well, why not? See, the Indian don't eat with no fork, same as Charlie. Indian treats his women free and easy, same as Charlie. Indian blows his nose with his fingers, same as Charlie. Now, you see, Charlie don't like himself so much, so he don't like the Indian any better. Seems fair enough, don't it, son? Deborah Paget is the lovely captive Indian girl. Soft-spoken, desirable. That baby ain't yourn, is it? His mother was killed. The child got anybody? Anybody close, I mean? The baby belongs to all people. Ain't that a fact, though? Yes, these hard men could display warm tenderness, as well as cold steel. Thought I told you to put that gun away. I could shoot out both your eyes before you took another step. Sure, you'd kill me, Charlie. But while you're doing it, I'd gut you from belly to brisket. Humorous, human, yet tough as nails, The Last Hunt is a picture that pulls no punches. <laughs> 